Hello everyone, Equipman War here, and welcome to episode uh, 21 of my Let's Play Beginner Dual Will Do list. Today we are going to defeat Domnus, as I said before in my last episode, and I have taken. Uh, I have uh, when go in here to a set of guard and get the waypoint. So now we go up into upper scepter of God. See if we can defeat uh, uh, Dominus. And my plan is actually to see if we can take down. Uh, what was the name for that idiot again? Uh, Vol. In this episode, at least I'm gonna try. So let's see what's happening. Let's just see what's happening. And I actually think about really try to ramp up this uh, playthrough or whatever we're gonna call it this guide because I should actually do it a little bit faster right now I'm I'm way too slow when I'm making these episodes Ooh, those enemies do a bit damage actually oh now I know why they knock back me that much they have a brutal shrine on them that was really annoying Let's open that. What, uh, what 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 can go wrong? Go wrong. And uh, actually, an item I need to upgrade. I need to get a bed, a pair of better boots to this character because one lost in uh, <laughs> this level, uh, it's starting getting a little bit. Uh, what 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 we call it now? Too low level. So I need to get a pair of, uh, a pair of real boots, and I'm not gonna trade for them. I think I'm gonna craft them instead. Let's see if I can craft. Uh, I, I'm actually gonna keep my eye open for a nice pair of uh, boots. Uh, don't doesn't have to be uh, be magic boots. Just uh, I just need some boots with armor or armor evasion. Pure uh, pure evasion will work, but it's not. Optimal, but I have, if I remember right, I have, yeah, I have re iron reflectors, so I can go with uh, pure evasion boots as well. But we will see. Should drop some, some boots. Eventually, but I should starting to think about upgrading my gear now. The armor I'm using is just fine, the weapon is fine, but all the other things I should really be upgraded now. And I'm gonna do some more self find. I'm not just gonna trade for it, so I'm gonna f fix it myself. Let's see if we can find a way to Dominus. I believe I'm gonna get, gonna get a new level. <coughs> so it. Three of those enemies. Oh, I think I'm walking the wrong way. Ah, that was the right, right way. This is the last level before Dominus. So now it's going to get interesting. And it's time for some Dominus fighting. What do I have in resistance? Light resist are good. Light resist is actually the most important thing you need against Dominus because you do a ton of lightning spells and lightning damage and all of that good nonsense. Oh, I should use that uh, pair of boots. I forgot to have that, the, those boots here. So I actually think I'm gonna use them. Yes, I need Welcome that life. Yeah, yeah, Dominus, you are so... You're thinking too high of yourself. <coughs> hmm, get rid of you. At least I can try. You're dead. That chest splitter, you never know if that are a good weapon or not. It is not better than the one I have. But it, it could be, you never know. 
Let's see if we can take down Sparkfist. Hello, Sparkfist. <laughs> I never give up, Thomas. A lot of terrifying. Stop blinding me, it's not nice doing that. Get that helmet. Holy shit! I can't fight them just the safe way. I'd rather walk into the cold damage here than taking some of his. Uh, Do I can a tank through that? I don't want to get hit by that. I need to be careful here. Here you did your teleport attack. I should actually move my flask. I should not do that when he's shooting against me, but... Oh shit! <laughs> I know it's an illusion XA. And I'm just... Actually, I'm gonna go and refill my... Yes, fast refill my flasks. Because they are completely empty. I'm not gonna die on this boss. I'd rather go back to town. So actually I'm gonna move my flask again how like that. That was weird. For safety, I don't wanna die. I can just, I have a lot of portals, I can just do it like that. But you, Domnus, you are about to die. I really need some better defense, I can see that my uh, physical uh, protection is pretty low. Take a look at this helmet here. Well, this is not a good, better helmet than the one I have, but I have a good fire resist. I don't have maxed out fire resist, but I don't think it is better than the helmet I'm using because I need some more life. And strength and uh, life is actually a good combination. Again, I'm gonna keep my eye out for new boots. But when I'm gonna go here on the aqueducts, I think I'm gonna cut right there. So I see you guys in uh, Highgate. So welcome to Highgate, everyone. So let's go down here to the dried lake and see if we can uh, kill uh, Vol actually to get access to the to the mines. We're actually starting getting closer now to get to Merciless. Then there's not a long way left to starting with maps. At least that's my plan at least. I'm gonna try to be a little bit faster as I said before with these episodes. As I had way too much other things I wanted to do. Oh, so many films I want to... Uh, so many clips I want to film and so little time. <laughs> We actually got a level right now, so uh, let's put out our passive skill point before we have uh, laid these enemies to rest. 
I think I'm gonna go... I never remember what I said before. And I should stop aggro more enemies and actually put my skill point there. As I said, I'm gonna go for a... More of a... I'm gonna go for a mana base build instead of a... Instead of... Yeah. So let's take some life and armor. Sorry for that, I just need to lock my door so no one get in here and interrupt me as usual. Actually, life and armor. Yeah, I go for that. I need some more life. So I go for that in anyway. So you can find vol. It always takes lo a really long time to actually find vol when you are searching for him. Here we have the, one of the most dangerous enemies you can fight. Because he has a very, very hard uh, shooting attack. He can do that enemy. Hey, you can hit, and can't hit me here. Good. But I do not want to fight that enemy. So I'm going to run away like a coward. Uh, he has a ton of hit points and he do a ton of damage. And I'm, uh, my idea is actually when I gonna upgrade my weapon, if I not find an upgrade or craft it myself, and I will probably actually craft one and try to craft one myself when I find the next tier of item. I'm gonna buy uh, a better axe from uh, PA Trader, but I want to use my favorite base type of axe, which are seat axe. You can get a really good seat axe for like no price at all. I can't use it yet because I need level uh, 59. Holy shit, we got a unique ring, guys. Or girls. Depending on who watching this video. Let's take a look. I think that's Pi. Pi. Whatever it's called. Yes, this. Uh, not a bad ring. I don't know. That's probably not a good idea to actually use this ring. Even if this a pretty nice ring, but not the, not the right ring for me at least. Where can Wall be? I'm not gonna complain, I'm getting good experience here. Yeah? It's actually a pretty good uh, farming place as well, to farm in here. There are a ton of enemies. We're getting good experience. Just a good farming place, as you can see. I'm almost halfway to level again. Could do some farming here, actually. I don't know if I want to. I'd rather do the farming in uh, Merciless instead. But this is a good farming place if you happen to be here and have a little bit too low level. I think we have, we have find Vol. I'm gonna get rid of these enemies because I want some more experience. So if we're going to die, I put a portal here. Hello Vol, do you remember me? You're probably not doing that. He can be very dangerous. Uh, he's more than very dangerous, so that was so bad of me. Actually, I need to change my setup a little bit. I'm gonna use life flick so I get some more life back. Instead of... Uh, I'm gonna lower my damage to have more survivability. That was the reason I put a portal here. God awaits you. Yes, I'm gonna send you to him. That is a dangerous attack. You, if you're standing in front of him, you have a lot bigger. Ooh, that was close. AoE with that than if you are just uh, standing behind them. Ooh, that was close. I actually got hit by it, but it didn't do that much damage. I need to get my life back up.
That did do a little bit damage to me. And now you are defeated. Okay, I gotta tr throw away that item. So don't forget to get the banner. Any more good things to get here? It was unfortunate I died before there. But uh, whatever. <laughs> Let's gonna say that. Uh, let's see, what was I thinking about? Ah, I forget what I think about. So let's go back to Highgate. And I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Because I don't want to do so long episodes anymore as I had did in the beginning because they were too long, <laughs> if I am honest. I think it's better to do a little bit shorter episode. Hmm, actually, first I'm gonna take that axe. Maybe that is a good axe, you never know. That have very good elemental damage and crits. Actually, that's, that must be the next tier of axes. Ref axe. So, if I'm gonna craft an axe, I'm probably gonna use that base type. So, uh, let's identify some crap here. Well, let's sell it. Actually, I gotta keep that ring for now. And I'm going to change my mana flask. I'm actually going to destroy that. And as usual, this is my stash for this character. Let's put in all our currency. Actually, before we end, let's do see if we can do some crafting here. Let's talk to Kira here. Yeah, you can watch me as, l as long as you want. I don't care. Uh, let's see if you're selling anything interesting here. Some chromatic item, maybe. Sailor norm, normal axe. Oh, pretty nice base type, but mm, I'd rather wait to level to get the rare axe instead. Here we have some boots. Ancient graves. A bit too low level, if I can be honest. Any good helmet to buy? Yes, low level. Hmm. Worm, worm scale gauntlets. Actually, let's see if we can craft this to be better than these ones. Any more, any more interesting things? No, I don't think so. Yes, may fear guide me. Let's see if we can uh, have. A Actually, let's not do it that way. Let's do it. Let's craft them to a blue one. Hmm, it's not bad actually. Hmm. I just thinking, what is my resistance here? Resistance against fire is very good. Co uh, cold resistance is the baddest one. This one gives fire resist, so I'm actually gonna reroll that. Fire resist, life, attack speed, lightning resist. Accuracy, come on now, roll something good. Accuracy, armor, lightning, item rarity. You know what? Let's roll it uh, yellow anyway and hope for the best. Well, that was not good. I could use this. No, I'm not doing that. Let's. I'm going to have a much more worse coal resist if I'm doing this. Uh, actually. What do you need now? I could upgrade my belt actually. Hey, before you are so angry, uh, actually, you know, you two are selling belts. I really need some more life, so I'm actually gonna go for a leather belt. And let's use an alchemy on this one. And that's actually pretty nice. That's a good amount of life. And it gave me cold resist. So that's the upgrade. I'm going to get lower uh, armor. I'm going, going to get lower damage. But right now, life is a little bit more important. But I'm going to keep this belt here. This one have cold resist, but this one gives more cold resist than this one, so I'm still going to have more cold resist than before, and I really want 
to use this. Actually, let's buy another one. Let's buy another one. Um, uh, another uh, piece of gloves. Actually, these gloves, I can use them on just one level, so I get those instead. Yeah, you can watch me as best you want. I actually can sell the, those gloves because they were bad. Let's craft this one. Hmm. Actually, give me some life, so I'm going to keep that. So now I have an upgrade for when I'm leveling next time. Anyway, I hope you guys like this episode and uh, I see you all next time.